Good morning, everybody. Uh, I haven't found a better solution in this new room yet, other than holding my cell phone and making these videos, but I will soon have something better than I can move around a little bit more. Uh, this will just be very quick on the two big games yesterday. Um, the one that I saw more of, well, uh, mostly highlights, but I did see a little bit, was Wolves against Liverpool, which was actually quite a tricky matchup for Liverpool. Um, but you know, Wolves had the better of the game and then Salah makes the goal. It was as easy as that. And then from that on, Liverpool with a very mature uh, performance. I think before halftime, Wolves threatened a little bit more, but as soon as Van Dijk made it 2-0, by that time, Liverpool had asserted so much control on, on the game that it was well beyond the reach of Wolves. And, you know, I don't want to say a big word, but performances like these is what championship teams do. You don't see them a lot and then suddenly you make the goal, you get the breakthrough, you play it safely home and that's what Liverpool did yesterday. That was quite impressive and you know I'm really looking forward uh, to the December 3rd matchup between City and Liverpool. Uh, now Liverpool momentarily has four point lead. City can cut it. I think they play Crystal Palace. I said yeah, Everton yesterday but it's Crystal Palace. Uh, Tottenham Everton. Yeah. Crystal Palace, which they should get the three points. And yeah, it all points to that matchup on January 3rd. City against Liverpool. That will be the big one. There was a really big one yesterday in the Bundesliga between Dortmund and Gladbach. And unfortunately, I only saw goals. They say highlights will go online. Or the highlights were more or less the goals in one scene. But uh, Dortmund controlled proceedings. They clearly bounced back from losing midweek to Düsseldorf. Uh, Goethe providing the assist on Sancho's goal, although Goethe, the, Goethe and Reus made it actually a little bit slow and Sancho pulled up the speed and uh, hammered and shot from acute angle in. Uh, but right after that, uh, Gladbach hits back, um, getting uh, back Krama, the guy who 2014 World Cup final <laughs> um, got knocked out. Uh, he actually got the ball in his hands, but it was not uh, a movement towards the ball. It was more involuntarily, and then he slams it home. It was 1-1 at halftime. Uh, Dortmund set things straight uh, in the second half, having numerous chances uh, from what I hear. I saw the goal again, assisted by Götze on Reus, a wonderful attacking move, and then um, got finished off. Um, nah, not really got finished off, but Reus hit the post with a free kick and there Dortmund bounces back, has now uh, nine points on Gladbach again. And you know, Bayern can cut their lead short uh, to six. But yeah, uh, Dortmund looks, I think, overall good, but I, I hope that Frankfurt does something against Bayern today. Well, let me know about these two games. I'm gonna watch today mostly Serie A, uh, Milan Fiorentina. I'm traveling on that one. And then I will also watch um, uh, Juve Roma. And maybe I'll sprinkle in uh, some Premier League, maybe the Club World Cup. I don't know. We'll see about that. Maybe also some uh, La Liga. But I more in Serie A today, despite wearing PSG. <laughs> okay, let me know what uh, you thought about the games yesterday, uh, which games you're going to watch. Um, also, let me know uh, if you agree with my assessment. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video, subscribe to my channel right here and check out the playlists here and I will talk to you soon. Bye.